Let's count down the top 10 rides at Adventure Dome. Number 10 BC Bus. Now I'm not 100% sure what your buses are like, but as far as I am concerned, any bus that will fly above 2 feet into the air is a no-go for me. Well, that is until I met the bonkers BC Bus at Circus Circus, because unlike your normal bus trip to the mall or school, this bus will not actually take you anywhere, but rather rotate you and the other passengers on board up, down and around, again and again and again, both forwards as well as backwards, till it definitely drives somebody crazy. So it may be a little out of the ordinary, but it is perfectly parked on our top 10 list. Number 9 Canyon Cars Put your hands on the wheel and your foot to the metal, as our next attraction on our list has taken the phrase road rage to another level, with it being the park's bumper car ride. And for anyone who has not done one of these before, then brace yourselves, as in around two and a half minutes, you will purposely be driving cars into one another, whilst running away from the others, which especially in a larger group is so much fun. Whereas if you have dashed, crashed and bashed before, then we suggest trying the more unique adventures, such as our Loco first, as you can't experience that anywhere else. Number 8 Sand Pirates From buses to cars to now a pirate ship, already we've covered some awesome experiences, and it is only now continuing on this classic rocking ship, as what many people do not know about these is that the seat that you choose also controls the intensity of your voyage. Therefore, if you want to shiver your timbers like a true pirate captain, then anchor either back or front row, as you will rock a lot higher above the seven seas than the middle rows, which of course does not provide the same out of your seat sensation either, making it a great sale for ye younger pirates. Number 7 Disco Whether you have the moves or you are like me, make sure to get your sick bags at the ready, as similar to that scene of a Star Total Wipeout where everyone spins around so fast that they have no clue where they even are, your party were meant by getting that exact same sensation. But oh no, it does not stop there, as in addition to spinning in what has got to be one of the most uncomfortable restraints in existence, the disc that you are sat on will also be rocking along the U-shaped track, which you do not need to be a party animal to know, is a disco that you nor your stomach will never ever forget. Number 6 Nebuzar you know those rides, that riding always is a lot worse than it looks in the videos. Well, in this instance, it is a complete opposite. As even though from first sight, the near misses from the 32 feet high speed, consistently rotating arms, will keep the majority of riders on the edge of their seats. Riding on the other hand, will keep your hands in the air with its smooth rocking sensations and incredibly funny interactions with the other riders, surprisingly being quite enjoyable for the whole family. Just be sure to mention when getting off how scary it is, because any non-rider will think you're pretty brave taking on this adventure. Number 5 Chaos One thing that stands out about Adventure Time is its collection of dizzy rides, but even the majority of them do not come anywhere close to the almighty chaos, which as you can only imagine, is not for the faint of heart. Nevertheless, the idea of being freely rotated upside down on a giant spinning disc that is then also tilted to an almost vertical angle for an eternity sounds fun to you. Then go right ahead, as there is a reason there is only 3 out of the 22 original versions of these thrill attractions still remaining, and I can guarantee you that it is not because riders find it boring.
Number four inverter. Going upside down will always make me laugh or scream. But our next adventure on our list, inverter, will keep you upside down for so long that even my screens will come to an end before you are the right way up. Because when normally your gondolas will freely spin along with the fully rotating arm, what makes this one one of my favourite attractions out there to both ride as well as watch is that in fact the gondola will move in the opposite way than you would have expected, meaning that you will often be flung outwards and held upside down for some crazy lengths of time, hence the name Inverter. Number 3 Slingshot If you are scared of heights, then it's probably best to look away now. Actually, just don't look up, as whilst you'll be lucky enough not to be shot into the air by two thin strings of elastic, I can't say the thrills are not as intense. With before you even know what you're getting yourself into, your seat being shot to 100 feet, providing some of the best views that you can get across the dome and also 4Gs of acceleration force, all before dropping back down again, not once, but twice. So yeah, this is crazy, but if I had to choose between this and a real slingshot, I would choose to do this drop tower any day of the week. Number 2 Canyon Blaster Yeehaw adventurers, and welcome to the wild experience in the dome, as after a lot of thought and consideration, between this and our number one spot, we have decided to place this classic 1990s Canyon Blaster in this position. Nevertheless, to think that a coaster of this scale, featuring four inversions, giant drops, tunnel sections, and some of the best theming I think I've ever seen, is all fit into one giant dome, really shows how great this place is. Therefore, for that factor alone, a trip to Circus Circus would be nowhere near complete without blasting in, out and around the canyon. Number 1 El Loco El Loco, El Loco, El Loco Where do I begin when talking about this legendary coaster? Not just home to a very awesome onboard soundtrack, lap bar restraints and some once again amazing views, but also one of the most unique layouts out there. And I think as soon as you realise that the entire 1,300 feet of track is in such a tiny footprint, it is very easy to know why. However, it is where you dare to take a ride that you realise its full craziness, as everything from those outer bank turns, to 90 degree drops, to some serious upside down stalling, creates a rush truly like nothing else. Thank you all for watching, bye bye.